everybody. Happy Friday and welcome. It is I, your songwriting partner, your co-producer, and as always, your friend, Joe CB. Happy Friday again, guys. And Friday is part of our writing series. We write a melody. And today is our melody writing day. Um, yesterday was our um, creative writing class that we call Picture This. So when I show you a photograph, and you guys should have all been writing uh, a chorus based on the photograph that I showed you yesterday. Um, I did that as well. And so today, we are going to give birth. We are going to create, not give birth, but we are going to create a melody based on the lyrics that I wrote. Okay? Now you guys, you know, I want to tell you guys something. You can do this on your own too. If you want to write a melody yourself... Go ahead, you know, write a melody, try to write a melody, try to write a melody for your words, you know, but I got to understand the melody. It can't be so out of tune that I just, it just sounds like a rigmarole. It's got to sound, it's got to have structure to it. It's got to have like a melodic structure. Um, we'll talk about that in a minute, but I really do want to hear, um, if you want to write a melody, please go ahead. And I'd love to hear the melodies that you write for this. Um... So, or even try writing a melody to, to my words if you want to. Um, just, um, you know, text me, message me, and tell me you want the words, and I'll send you the words to the song. So, um, not a problem at all. So, anyway, um, I'm going to read you the words first, and then I'm going to show you how I constructed the melody that I came up with for this, okay? So... Let's recap the words which I created yesterday. So it's, there's something about you, I can't explain it. When you're around, my heart can't contain it. And you make me feel like my feet can't touch the ground. There's something about you that makes me crazy. My heart is racing, my head is hazy. And you make me feel brand new because there's something about you. So that's the whole thing, right? So, you know how I was saying, like, when I, when I start writing things, I listen to stuff. I'll go listen to a whole bunch of new stuff on, you know, Billboard or, you know, just go to YouTube and I'll listen to new releases on YouTube. Um, and, uh, I just listened to a whole bunch of them, you know, um, not any one in particular. I'll just let a whole bunch flow past me. And then from my memory, you know, I'll get like excited about one or two things that I heard. And, uh, <clears throat> and that happened to me, um, creating this. So, um, you know, the, to, um. Uh, to answer the question, um, if anyone has this question anyway, what is a melody? A melody is the tune in which a song is to be sung, right? Um, that's Mary Had a Little Lamb. That's the melody to Mary Had a Little Lamb. So the melody is the tune, not lyrics. The melody is the tune. Okay. Now that we have that, um, so um, what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to, let me grab my guitar. Um, so the first thing I did, um, you know, um, um, <clears throat> so um, I just started playing some chords, right? And looking at the picture and I looked at the picture and I started playing some chords, right? So I played a B. Um, I played B major. I like singing in that key anyway. So I use that as a springboard to just start uh, my melody. And I kind of heard a melody pretty quick. So I started to go... There's something about you, there's something about you, I can't explain it. I like that, right? 
Um, I thought that was nice. And there's something about you I can't explain it. I thought, um, you know, so I started, you know, just going, there's something about you I can't explain it. When you're around, my heart can't contain it. I thought that was nice. There's something about you I can't explain it. When you're around, my heart can't contain it. Where did I, where can I go from there? And I wanted to change it really completely right there. So, um... You know, I started, you know, thinking, where can I get, do, do I keep going in that kind of, um, in that rap? Or do I change it up right there, all together? So I thought, it might be nice to switch it up. So, you know, I like the beginning. I established the, uh, you know... So I like that. There's something about you I can't explain it When you're around I can't contain it I thought, where can I go? Oh, I like that, right? So we're going, um, There's something about you I can't explain it When you're around my heart can't contain it Woo! I thought that was cool, right? So, so. I thought that's really pretty. And I like saying the word you instead of just going woo. So I, you know, it was already you know written there you. So I um. There's something about you I can't explain it When you're around, my heart can't contain it You What should I do now? Made me feel like my feet can't touch the ground Oh, I thought that was nice. So we're going, There's something about you I can't explain it When you're around, my heart can't contain it the ground oh i like that did you guys like that that's I, I it made me have a feeling of some sort you know so whenever whenever i'm writing something and i start having a, a good feeling in my my heart you know like i know i'm on to something you know if i'm going the wrong way i can kind of feel it you know so that's not the whole thing though so because I wanted to, you know, I didn't want to sing it once. I, and then I wanted to come up with some variations. So what I did was I went, um, There's something about you I can't explain it When you're around, my heart can't contain it You made me feel like my feet can't touch the ground There's something about you that makes me crazy My heart is racing I just so you know I thought <clears throat> that's really pretty like I, I can sing that it's pretty even without the chords right so here it is like acapella right there's something about you I can't explain it when you're around my heart can't contain it you make me feel like my feet can't touch the ground there's something about you that makes me crazy. My heart is racing, my head is hazy. You make me feel brand new cause there's something about you. You know, and the rest are just kind of embellishments. But like, 
you know, you can sing that without music and it sounds pretty still. And that's kind of like the strength of what a melody is supposed to do. Like a melody, a melody should be strong enough that you don't need the music under it to give you a, a feeling of melody. You know what I mean? Like the Star Spangled Banner is sung a lot without any music. It's someone just standing at a microphone and singing it, right? It's because that melody is so strong and it's so universal, we all know it now, that you don't even need the music under it. You almost feel the music without even hearing it. And like, that is really, you know, a strong melody. Like a melody is very strong. You know, if you listen to like Beatles, oh my God, the Beatles, the melodies of the Beatles are just, some of the Beatles melodies are insane good, where you don't even need any music for them to be super melodic. And I always, you know, I always go back to that way of thinking, the Beatles songbook kind of mentality. No matter what kind of music you like, um, melody will always be in. Whether you like rap, hip hop, pop, R&B, heavy metal, it doesn't matter. Melody is in all those genres, so don't let it fool you. Um, there's melody in all of it, you know, some more than others, but still, um, you know, if you can sing along to it and it's pretty, you know, think of Hey Jude. Na, 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 hey Jude. You know, that's so melodic. You know, um, and even the melody before it gets to that part is just insane, beautiful and melodic. So, you know, when you're writing a melody. Oh, and if I had to derive that scale, if I had to, you know, trace back the scale that goes to this melody that I created, it would be a major scale. A major scale. It, it's a major scale because it's a major chord progression. So. Um, it would be a B major scale to go over that. So that's where, if you had to trace it back to its origin of scale, it's a melodic major scale in the key of, um, B, which is B major, which is where I started writing the song in that key. Cause that's a good, that's a good place for my voice. I know my voice well. I know what's gonna flatter my voice and what keys are gonna work with my voice and which ones won't. So, all right, guys. Well, I'm gonna do the whole thing now for you with the uh, arrangement that I, I did a little arrangement. You know how I always do. So here we go. Here we go. There's something about you I can't explain it. When you're around, my heart can't contain it. You make me feel like my feet. And that's the whole thing, guys. I hope you enjoyed that. So that is all the time we have for tonight. This is your songwriting partner, your co-producer, and as always, your friend Joe CB signing off. Have a great weekend, guys. Be safe. I love you. I miss you. And I will see you guys on Monday. Have a blessed weekend. Love you. Peace.